One of the biggest emotional traps that we often fall into is to compare ourselves or our situation to that of others. No matter how you look at it, there's just no good outcome to it. You will either feel that you are better than other people and be prideful, or you will think that you are worse off than them and feel jealous of them. Even during this time of lockdown, this is happening. People who are continuing with their jobs, they look at people who are staying at home and they wished it could have been them. People who are staying at home look at those who are going to work and they wish that they could be in that situation and earn an income. Those with children still going to school wish that they could also stay at home with their children, while those people trying to homeschool their children wish that their children would just go to school. People are just naturally inclined to compare themselves with other people and almost always long for the grass on the other side of the fence because it almost always looks greener than what you have on your side of the fence. And this reminds me of the story of the man who lived on the edge of a massive valley. And every morning he would get up and he would look out over the valley to the house that was built on the other side. And he would be filled with envy because it looked as though that house had windows that were made of pure gold. And so one day he felt so jealous of the house that was on the west side of this valley and looked so much better than his ordinary house that he decided to have a closer look. And so he set out about lunchtime and by the time he climbed the final part of the cliff on which the house stood, the sun was just beginning to set behind that house. And as he looked at it, he thought it was just an ordinary house, very much like the one he lived in. And so he was quite disappointed. And then he turned around and he looked over to the other side of the valley, the east side. And he saw that his ordinary house now had golden windows. It was obviously just the sun that was reflecting on the windows of, of the houses in the morning or in the evening. However, it just suddenly dawned on him that he already had so much to be grateful for. Why on earth would he be envious of anyone else? And so with a grateful heart, he began the long walk back home, satisfied with what he had. And so friends, when you feel yourself stepping into the comparison trap, remember just how much you have to be grateful for, that your windows may indeed already be golden and resolve to make the most of whatever you've got.